Hi guys! Oh wait, no, that's your line. Sorry, my bad. <laughs> no way. <laughs> the video's been going for less than a minute and you've already used a ball joke. Ladies and gentlemen, you asked for it. Squad build a showdown with Bateson and I have delivered. Hi guys! <laughs> Mate, you know since going bald, I've had so many people call me bald. Uh, like, that's probably because you're bald, mate. No, I'm fully like, that's fine, you can do that, you know To me, be I fair, actually, you were bald anyway. Since you've stopped spraying your hair on, you've had so many people calling you bald, is that what you mean? Yeah, mate, i got like a McDonald's hairline, right, that people can now see. But also, like, my Twitch chat and everything, even like, everything that I've, even if I tweet from it, so I tweet something like, I hope everyone has a nice day. Someone's like, I didn't call you baldy, baldy. I'm like, what? Like, I actually do feel sorry for bald people now. Well, I'm bald. Oh, you are bald, though. Yeah, I'm bald. You Everyone call calls me bald. me bald. You are also bald. Just just get over it, mate. It's fine. I mean, Your you are actually bald. Good. I am not bald, so, I mean, water off a duck's back to me. Actual painful truth to you. But <laughs> people are just me. Just got to ignore them, mate. Everyone just keeps commenting on my stuff like, what have you done? <laughs> You like, are bald. I do what? just keep sending them voice notes saying you are bald. Yeah, by the way, every single day. Like you were, Andy was 24 minutes late or 22 minutes late for Squad Brothers Showdown. And the messages I got from him were, just making a coffee, if that's okay, baldy. And he sent me a voice note this morning saying, good morning, I just want to let you know that you're bald. That's like, not what I said. What did Strung you say? along a bit. I said, hey mate, just a quick reminder before we film that you're bald. Yeah, that was the one, yeah. You also sent me a very, very toxic one. Just the other day. <laughs> that one was funny. <laughs> oh. That one was mean. I don't know if I want to repeat that on a video. No, I probably, I probably wouldn't for the, for the purpose of the video. It wasn't yeah, toxic I'm... to FG. It was no, not toxic at all. about myself. You can't be toxic to me though. Like, you can you all call me. Should I tell them what it said? Yeah, come on, why not? All right, so was a bit mean. If you wonder why FG is bald, by the way, he has just finished the charity stream. We're actually me and James made Pingu discard some money for you by doing really well on FIFA Millionaire. Discard yeah. some money? Donate some money. Jesus yeah. Christ, it's early. Did you say discard some money? Yeah, just buy any money. <laughs> just give it to charity. Discard it. Like, no, we made them donate some money to that was very kind of you, yeah. FG's charity thing, which was good. How much did you raise? Like eight grand or something mental yeah, I think like it's that. it's like nine and a half grand now. Jeez. Which is, which is like, for that charity that I did, I did it for Friends Fighting Cancer. That's their biggest donation I've ever had, which is... That's cool. Unbelievable. So, yeah, it's wasn't that me, though. Cool. It's everyone who donated, of course. I just... Yeah, so that is why FG's bald, Zell. That was one of the donation targets. Yeah, they want it. I mean, well, I've got no beard either. I do look like a thumb, to be fair. Like, you, you're more than welcome. Like, the fact that we managed to raise that much money for charity, you are genuinely more than welcome to abuse me as much as possible. You can do that anyway. Like, it doesn't really matter. But, I mean, I well, sort of do deserve the, the abuse now. Like, I'm looking at myself and I look like a thumb. I mean, like FG have got a... Running joke, I guess, of sending each other voice notes that start off as if they're really, really serious, and you just sit there for like 30 seconds listening to them, and it's just something stupid at the end. Oh, you had me in the last one so bad. I've, I've sent you a few of them, and you've sent me a few of them. I can't remember what they were. It usually involves from me, like making up some stupid name. Like, I asked you if you'd seen my Cal Balak last night. Yeah, uh, yeah. And you were like, what's a Cal Balak? And it's like, yeah. hey, Cal Balak. You know what? I need to just... stop replying to your messages without reading them 25 times before I get it. So <laughs> I was he just packed Michael got, Balak. Right, ended my stream and then I got that text. I was like, who? And I was like, oh, for God's sake. <laughs> like, a minute later, I realised. But, oh. Yeah. So I sent FG a really heartfelt voice note about the fact that he'd just done a... <laughs> live stream raising money for a cancer charity and um, for the people who don't know my dad actually died off cancer like i don't know 10 11 years ago something crazy like that so i sent fg a really like heartfelt voice note about how it means so much to me and it was really really nice and if my dad was here he'd probably just want me to say that you are really really bald and he listened to this like big long voice note oh it was, it was like so a nice. minute as well. it just ended like you are bald it was like a minute long and I was listening to it and I was like, wow, this is the nicest voice note Andy's ever sent me. Like, it means a lot that I've managed to help him. And then he called me bald and I was like, wait, what? And <laughs> such a reply saying, I hate you, mate. Like, he had me, so that was the best one you've ever done. Like, by far. Like, I, oh, it means so much to me, FG. And you are bald. Yeah, I mean, fair play to you. No, that was, that was, that was a good one. That was I'll good give one. you that one. You did one. I did genuinely listen to one for about two and a half minutes once. Anyway, never mind listening to voice notes for two and a half minutes, FG. This is serious business, mate. I know this is actually like, well, for you it is. I mean, I don't care. I mean, look at him. He's 
average. Everton have two special cards. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's got robbed on as well. Oh, sorry, yeah, free. I do keep wiping Rond on from my memory. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, what about Anthony Gordon? We don't... What? Everton have three special cards. Right. But only two of them are available for me. Where's your Anthony Gordon? Wouldn't I like to know? Did you not Disappeared into some SBC somewhere. What, did you have to discard him? Into the abyss, yeah. Yeah. Who made you do that? Harry Hesketh. Yeah, I knew that. I tried to bring it back. Brilliant. <laughs> Thanks, mate. Yes, Harry. What a man. Oh, inject it. I can't go on like this. If we, if I discard this Calvert-Lewin, the only Everton special card I can put in a team is Rondon. Have you not used him yet? He's good. Calvert-Lewin? No, Rondon. Shut up. <laughs> He's actually oh good. Oh, my God. If I discard this, Dominic Calvert-Lewin from you, I've won. Like, no matter what happens, I have won. Oh, so I could send you the... Biggest, longest, 15-minute voice note and get you to listen to the whole thing just to say you're bald at the end and i still be losing. <laughs> this this Calvert-Lewin card, by the way, um, I've played nine games with him, scored 10 goals and two assists. It definitely wasn't squad battles last night for icon swaps, but he's actually good. He's got a trampoline first touch, though. Does he actually? Oh, mate. It's but he's first got four-star skills. He's actually a really good card, to be fair. How's he got a trampoline to first touch and 90 ball control? He goes to Arsenal in the summer, like... It's actually really nice for him to give him, like, it's like an end of an era sort of card, isn't it? <laughs> Shut up. Because <laughs> <laughs> he's on his way. <laughs> oh, yeah. Nah, Frank's Lamp Frank Lampard, taking us all the way to the top, mate. I think so as well. I actually like Lampard. I hope, I hope. I've said it since day one. I genuinely I mean, hope. He's the best footballer well. to ever play for your club. And now he's the Everton manager. How do you feel? Yeah, him or Patrick Vieira, I'd say, yeah. But yeah, it's nice. It's, it's a stepping stone before he replaces Pep. Hopefully in like 25 years when Pep leaves. There is a lot of talk about Pep signing a new contract, isn't there? Oh, I know, mate. All of the players have signed contracts and don't even get me excited. All of the players have literally signed contracts. Like they're not going to sign contracts to play under like Brendan Rodgers. They must know Mikel something. Arteta, mate. Yeah, Arteta's actually a good, a low-key good manager, by the way. I think. I wish we'd have got him instead of Rafa. Yeah, but I was feel it Rafa, like now... Was it, no, it was instead of Ancelotti, I think, wasn't it? Was it? Oh, yeah. Which, in sure, hindsight, yeah, obviously, everyone would pick Arteta now. But at the time, everyone would obviously pick Ancelotti instead of Arteta. Of course, yeah. But, I mean, so I don't you know. I feel like mind. Everton will, will sort of get things right now. I mean, it's pretty sharp. Mate, in the situation. did you see how much pos we had possession? We passed the ball from defence to midfield instead of just hoofing up the pitch or passing inside these. It's you guys have a very good squad, though. Like, this is what I don't understand. Like, oh, I thought Rafa whole situation with Rafa was mental. Like, you got a very good squad, and I think you will do well. I'm pretty certain That's crazy. you'll do well. I hope you do anyway, for, for the sake of my friend Liam, who seems to get a mention every time. Not we're... because of me. No. Oh, okay, fine. No, I don't care about you. I want you to suffer. What a terrible person. Got a new background as well. Well, I don't. I've got the makings of a new background. My couch has arrived. Uh, what? A casting couch? Or... The cast are on it. Yep. Yeah, the cast of Pokemon. <laughs> why, why, have you got a, why have you got a sofa? Is it a black sofa? No, it's... Mustard. All right, okay. I was going to say, because if it's a black sofa, you're sending the complete wrong message there, eh, mate. And it's got a lovely canvas painting of Lando Norris in the... I can't remember the name of it. The special seen... Monaco livery for McLaren, which I have the hoodie of and I can't remember the name of. I've actually seen that on your... I think you tweeted it, didn't you? I did. Looks good, doesn't it? It actually does look very nice. It is yeah. currently sat on the couch because it was Katie it. holding it up on the tweet. You didn't design that. I didn't design what? You've not designed your background. Your better half has done all of that, 100%. Yeah, well, obviously. Come on, let's not... it actually is nice. The hairlines have dropped back on that picture. What was it called? <laughs> Why are you just ignoring what I said? I'm honestly not listening to you. I said your hairlines have dropped back on that picture. Oh. The golf livery! The golf livery! That's what it's called. There we go. Anyway, FG. Yes, my friend. Shall we do... I am a known waffler. Yeah, so my apologies. I, we, we have waffled a lot. A lot. Poor Harry's got to somehow edit this into, like, coherent chit-chat that's actually engaging. Cry more, Harry. I actually messaged Harry last night and tried to get some tips from him, but he, and I offered him money, but now I've modded him because he's neighbour. Speaking of Harry, actually, he, of course, does play in pro clubs. You play in pro clubs, FG. We've... The previous video we uploaded was pro clubs. Go and watch yeah. pro clubs, ladies and gentlemen. Pro clubs is very fun. Pro clubs is very, very fun. I appreciate you getting involved in that. It's very, very fun. I think that's well, a really I appreciate fun game mode, you know? Well, yeah, but the YouTube algorithms are pain in the arse because it doesn't like you uploading different stuff. Yeah. Whereas Pro Clubs is obviously very different, so it doesn't, like, share the video around as much. So if you're watching this video and you enjoy Squabble the Showdown and you enjoy all the chit-chat and the waffle and the 
ridiculousness between us. Imagine if there was four of a guests, Danny, James, Kerbs, and Editor Harry. Three and a half with Kerbs. Yeah, true. Well, two and a half and an editor. But... <laughs> oh, no. Harry's actually sensational at editing that video, by the way. Like, the yeah, they are very good. Go and watch them. There's been two so far, by the time yeah. you guys are watching this one. A couple of weeks ago, we uploaded the very first one, and we recorded another one, which Harry is currently struggling to render, but hopefully by the time a couple of the show runs out, he will have sorted. So that'll be on my channel as well. Go and check them out. They're very, very fun. I really enjoy making them. Yeah, Not quite sure Harry enjoys editing them, because there's so many people involved, but they do come out very good videos. Anyway, go and watch that once you've watched this. What formation would you like? Um, I would like the four two three one, the second variation, please. You can have the four two three one, the second variation, please. Thank you very much. What would you like? Four two three one, the second variation. I've written four two three one, the second variation. No, you haven't. No, I'm not. <laughs> I no, wrote you four, haven't. Triple that's two. I literally came into this video <laughs> thinking I'm copying this formation. He hasn't written it down. Oh, that's actually that's a big brain move. That's you've set the press. All right, okay, you've set the tone for the video there. I'm impressed. Well done. It's an awful formation, by the way. No, nah, it's good. The wide formation, that's nah, shambolic, mate. Big Dom, 99 jump and 99 head and accuracy. Shambolic. All right, same formation Six as me. Six foot vertical nice. leap this man's got. Put that on my foot bin. Should we get into the first picks? Let's go. In we go to the first picks then. I did snake you by copying your formation, so I'll give you the choice. Do you wanna go first or second? Um, I will go second, please. All right. I'm going, after watching it last night, for an AFCON-themed left mid, right mid. We'll have Player of the Month Mo Salah and second in form Sadio Mane. You definitely support Liverpool. If they keep me my Calvert-Lewin, support anyone, mate. That's actually, yeah, okay, not bad. Not bad. Um, in that case, I will go for an African Cup of Nation theme and I will go second in form Mane and Player of the Month Salah, please. <laughs> Shut a note. <laughs> Oh, why did I not think you were going to do that? I put Sterling and Jota. <laughs> Fair play. Touche. Touche, FG. Touche. Nice. Okay. Lovely. I was actually going to put Sterling and Jota as well. No, you weren't. Um, Shut no, up. I was going to put Sterling and then I was going to... Were you actually... Oh, yeah. I should have made you go first. I was, <laughs> was going to put Sterling, but I just thought I'd just copy you as well, mate. Why not? Oh, oh nice. Mo Shala. Okay. Lovely. Did you watch the African combinations? Uh, I did, yeah, I did actually. Um, Lauren nil nils towards the end. There was it, it was yeah, it was the referee was awful as well. We thought the prem was bad, but the referee we have got was so bad, mate. But it was alright. It was alright, mate. And I, I didn't watch much of it. I watched the semi-finals and I watched the final. The final was a bit. Yeah. yeah. So both this, both of Egypt's games in the semi-final and the final were a bit stale, really, weren't they? They were obviously just playing to their strengths. I just think, yeah, I think. When Mane missed that penalty, if you watch the Mane documentary made in Senegal, no, I want, you should watch that. It's on. I think it's actually on YouTube, you know. Oh really? Yeah, but he's, it, it's it's just a mental documentary, and I've gained a lot of respect. For him. Obviously, they're both class though as well, like Mane and Salah. So it's it's, it's just a bit. It's going to be interesting. I I, might, I wish I could go in the change room, Liverpool change room, with some popcorn for the next week. Just to see what's happening. You know. Bit weird. Should we move on? Let's move on. <laughs> All right then, FG. Cam, two CDMs. Who are we both using? <laughs> right. Well, um, I'm going to go with someone. I, well, I've always wanted to use this card. And I really like him. Scored in the FA Cup. I hope he doesn't go to Man United. I'm going to use Declan Rice. Okay, I don't like that silence. Then I'm going to use. A card I've never used before, Yuri Tillemans. I He played in the FA Cup this week, but I think he might be missing. Um, and then at Cam, I'm going to use... Who are we going to use? I'm going to use Winter Wildcard, Lucas Mora. Can we, I was, oh, I hate to say it because it's the most cliche thing in the world. I was so close. I wanted to write down Smith Rowe and Lucas Mora, <laughs> but I couldn't because if Smith Rowe's got a centre mid card, I'm going to be fuming because then I could have. Um, he has not, I don't He has not, no, so I didn't think he did. So I couldn't write both of them. So I went with Smith Rowe because he's newer. That's really frustrating. And then I put Gundogan and Kevin De Bruyne. I was gonna, I was looking at Gundogan, but I just couldn't justify doing it. I was thinking, is he gonna risk that 
play a moment to Gundogan, maybe not, but then I am risking Cavalier, so maybe you put a bit on the line. I don't know. That's frustrating. No, I couldn't decide between Smith Rowe and Gundogan. And now the question is, do I go for Declan Rice, Yuri Tillmans, and Lucas Mora? Are you big brain enough to have written all three of them down on your whiteboard as well? <laughs> Imagine. I reckon you might have put one of them as a as a backup. And I reckon you've been, you, I say I reckon you've been doing your research. I know you've been doing your research. You've been bragging about it, about watching all of the Squad Builder showdowns and knowing all my players. I just enjoy the and, series. So you know that I've got Puskas, which is why I'm going to go for Prime Baggio. Did you write Puskas? No comment. Interesting. Flashback Kante. And, oh, because I've got Deli Alley, actually. When he converts to an Everton card, we'll do it. Have you written down all three of them? Do I go, Tealmans? I'll have Team of the Year, Jorginho. <laughs> will you now? I will. Okay, that's a really... I wrote down Balak as my icon, because I thought it was pretty funny. <laughs> um, if you do that, but obviously you've got that humour. I wrote Fred down, you know, that UCL okay. one. Yeah. Um, and then I also wrote Angolo Kante. It's so obvious that like, you're gonna use Kante. Like, I mean, come on, mate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fantastic! And I will be giving you a goalkeeper. I've just risked an extra million coins as well. Does oh, he... and plus Baggio. How much is Baggio? <laughs> I only picked him because I read it to Harry. I didn't think you were actually gonna pick Jorginho, to be fair. I did look over him. I was like, there's not a chance. Oh, um, right, can I give you a goalkeeper from which league do I need to give you one from? From the Prem, please, mate. No worries. Um, you can have. You can have Dan Langley, Newcastle United, and he's six foot seven. That's like a whole foot taller than you. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I'm, I'm not actually, you're not doing 12 months on a curb, so don't get that joke. Oh, no, then I just said a foot and a half. This is mad. This is, this is, oh. Okay, okay, okay. It's fine. It's fine. Should have written Lucas Mora. Shouldn't have picked Kante. It's fine. Wait, so if I had to copy you, I could have had them all? Yeah. Oh, I for Christ's actually, sake! I was actually thinking about I was actually thinking about writing them all down, but I just bottled. Oh. It looks like you bottled it as well. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I did. Yeah. Oh, let's put Langley in. Prime Baggio looks good, by the way. I told Harry to buy him for his team. He was. We've discussed this before on James's channel. Harry was watching Scobler Show Nine and Cine and called me out that I was slewing him for his FIFA ability. Because he was calling Varane and Kante bad. Interesting. As that you clearly are just terrible at FIFA then. I mean, yeah. I and mean, then his team, right, he had like 400k to spend and he spent 350 of it on Inform Van Dyke and Inform <laughs> Teo Hernandez. I was like, what are you doing? I love it. Spend That's some money on good players up front. So I told him to get Baggio and then he got really good at FIFA. So I'm claiming all of Harry's FIFA ability for myself and I'm going for Prime Badger instead. Yeah, this is this has not gone well, to be honest with you, mate. I knew you were going to make Kante, like, it was so obvious. Oh, I really hope you come last. So, we're doing a poll on the community page, the World Cup of Squabble the Showdown guests, where some people did get a bit confused and thought that that was going to be the Squabble the Showdown Cup. It's not. That's coming later. I'm not going to do the Squabble the Showdown Cup with 32 people. That would be mental. Logistical nightmare is what that would be. It would actually be a logistical nightmare. Yeah, that would be crackers. So what we've done instead is just everyone who's ever done Squabble the Showdown on my channel on theirs. We're just doing like a little bracket. Do you know the way like Richard Osman always does like the World Cup of Biscuits on Twitter it. and stuff yeah. like that? We're doing that but for Squabble the Showdown guests on the community page. So make sure you go and get involved in the voting. We've already had Group A where Atani and Atani ran away with it in first place and his way back comes Atani, second. Yeah. And in Group B was yesterday, where It's James ran away with it in first place. And then the Burn Chip, a bit of a throwback to like FIFA 17, coming in second. Group C contains you. Do you want to know who you'll be up against? Go on. Group C will be FG, Haber, Rotashaw, and Anise and Gibb. You've put me against Rotashaw, just so I can lose. I'm voting Rotashaw. <laughs> <laughs> 100%. It is a bit of a popularity contest, to be fair, but I guess it's a popularity contest on my channel. I'm genuinely voting Rotoshaw. <laughs> like, you think I'm joking, like, I'm voting Rotoshaw, mate. Because <laughs> he's insane. <laughs> <laughs> like, if it was a, cop a popularity contest on I'd vote Haber their second, channel, probably. And who was obviously, the other Harry would just win. Who was the other Gib person? Gib, Haber, Ewan, Oh, I'm voting Harry. Gib as well. Yeah, they're all three of them are clear. Yeah, okay, thanks, mate. Yeah. Next time, put me with, like, James. Well, James just got 70% of the vote on Group B. 
You sure that's what you want? Well, he's rent free, so I would like to. Yeah. Hopefully, when yeah. you do the when you do the squad builder World Cup or whatever you're going to call it, squad the showdown cup. Same thing. Um, I'll, I'll play James and knock him out. Okay. It's going to be interesting though. There's some good groups. We've got Group D: Danny Aaron's, Brooksy, Jared, and Rob. That's a very good group. Full of very group good, E: uh... Jack, Skills, Maverick Wars, Lasty. Oh mate, this is this is good. Group F: Tom Bateson, Theo Baker, and Matt HD. Reeve, Chufsters, Oakley, and Nepo. Pieface, Tex. JMX Joel, that's a throwback as well. And Harry Heskiff, that's a, a strong group. That is a very strong group, actually. I think all of the guests you have on Toy Builder Showdown are very, very good, though, to be fair. I remember Jared's episode, and I really liked it. Same, except I was still editing them back then. You know, the times I had to just mute them for saying something absolutely outrageous. <laughs> oh, mate. Bloody Australians, the Aussie, mate. The Aussie, the Aussie humour. He laughed at me about the ashes as well, I remember, which was a bit, a bit painful. I just do yeah. terrible in between Jared's his jokes, like references really nice to him guy. all the time. He's like a lovely man. 15 for bloody May 1989. Let's move on. <laughs> My turn to go first for the fullbacks then. And I'm going for something you wouldn't know anything about. A European Cup winning fullback combo. Okay. Ben Chilwell. Right. And Azpil Equator. I wrote Trent and I thought, yeah, I thought if I slammed the ball on the floor, it'd guarantee a win. And then I wrote Luca Dean, so congratulations, you have two fullbacks. Oh, now, moving on to me, do I copy you again? <laughs> that is the question. Oh, well, I mean, Ben Chilwell's shambolic, by the way. Um, so I won't be doing that, I won't be copying you. My left back is going to be someone who has got passion. Serious, serious passion. He literally fights for the badge like like I've never seen on this game. Do you know who I'm talking about? I don't. Okay. Well, he fights for the badge. Um, but now I'm scared because I think he would have run him down, so I'm not going to use him. Um, no, I'm going to use... <laughs> right, uh, there's three options. I could use Luca Dean. But that's just too obvious. I could use Reguillon. I've used him before. I want to go Tierney, but I'm scared that you've written him down. So I'm going to go Alex Teller. <laughs> you we got Alex Tellers. Yeah. Mark and play them with Salah. Yeah. And then Great. I'm going to go for Kyle Walker Peters. All right, back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're so B Tech. Who have you got? Who have you written down? I put Dinier. Because I, I, mean, I thought you'd be funny. Yeah. Think you're funny, do you? Yeah. And I put Cancelo. I actually just bottled all of that. Yeah. I've just I was, bottled the full back. When you like, said Tini, I was hating so myself. Bad me. I was second guessing whether to put Tini on her, and I was like, oh, I've got to put Dinier in case he's funny. And then when you said you were going to go Dinier, I was like, eh, Tini, I was like, oh, fuck. But you get away with it and you pick Tellers. And your fullbacks are terrible. Yeah, I know, but you're terrible, so I'm fine. You raise a good point. However, <laughs> I am also somewhat regretting not having Jorginho on Chilwell's side. Yeah. But then that removes the strong link from Azpi. I should have gone like Wamba Saka. So I don't know. Just tell Chilwell to stay back in it. He'll do a job. Well, he's going to have to, mate, to be honest. He is, because he's got Langley playing in front of him. Chilwell is shambolic. Don't stop slandering Ben Chilwell. He's awful. Yeah, he's not great. Slap a shadow on him, he'll be all right. You're in the mud, mate. I can pick literally anyone. Yeah, so... Data so you're not going to get them? All right, we'll see. I'm going to get yours. We'll see. And you've got Tellez and Kyle Walker-Peters. We'll see. We will. All right, on to the uh, defenders, then. Let's go. That's not, it's my job. Calm down. You can't be stealing Bateson's role and mine. <laughs> Let's move on to the centre-backs and goalie. <laughs> The final positions then. Time for my revenge, FG. First right. or second, mate? Uh, first, please. Ooh, go on then. Um, I'll have, I'm gonna keep this just this pain just because I messed up because it's gotta be like prem players and obviously I can use an icon. Sounds scared. I am a bit scared, you know. I'm not even joking. I'm gonna use Joe Gomez. 
Flashback for Rad and Persia. Honestly, respect. I'm not even mad. I was, I mean, I was dilly dallying over to put Joe Gomez, but I didn't put it in the end. I put Rudiger and Konate. I looked at Varane and thought, no way. Wait, who's no way now? he's going to use flashback Varane. So I didn't even bother it. And you know what? Respect, FG. You deserve to have a sick centre back for having the cojones to put that thing in a squabble shunner. What about the goalkeeper, Andy? Well, I obviously didn't write Petr Cech today. Come on. Well, wait, so why didn't you write an icon down when I haven't used an icon? Because it's just too hard to guess. You could have gone okay. Saul Campbell. You could have gone. Wait, so I can have Piero. all three? You could have gone. Yeah, I put Rudiger Canate de Gea. I was going to use Poppin' on wrist as well, but I bottled it. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, that's good. All right. Well, flashback brand's a massive risk, by the way. I'm crapping myself. I've lost my CDM. I don't want to lose my Calvert Lewin, but I, I respect that. I You've respect got. You can got basically respect pick anyone as centre back and goalkeeper, so I've definitely not got it. I right. wish I'd have written Joe Gomez because I was thinking about it, but I respect it. Okay, do you know what I want? Oh, yes, please. Kim Pembe. Okay. Koza. Okay. And second in Formula Font. Well, I wrote I did go French League, actually. But you put Marquinhos? Yeah. Donnarumma? Yes. Yeah. And. You didn't write Kim Pembe. Yes, I did. You didn't. <laughs> you didn't. No, 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 you didn't. No, you didn't. Why did you? No, 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 no. Why, 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 why? Because why, why, it was why, just why? so obvious. Why would you write all three? PSG it's not obvious, though. No, you got it wrong. Oh. It's the wrong ones. <laughs> oh, my God. Why? Oh, what a day. <laughs> oh, oh. I, was... I can't believe you've actually written. Oh, mate, out of all of the leagues, I just thought, you know what? There's a new team of the year keeper out. I've seen this new Cosa. And I thought, oh, that's that. I say this new Cosa. I seen this Cosa that I've never used before. He's an SBC. He's proper sneaky. I was like, yeah. yes, get him in my team. And I was like, right, he's gonna try. He's gonna write Marquinhos, maybe. He might write Donner. He's not writing. He's not covering all of them. He's gonna write Marquinhos. <laughs> oh my god! PK, I didn't know what else to Neuer, do. Something like that. What are you doing? Why have you no? <laughs> Oh, now I get to choose. Well, the good thing is, like, it won't be a goalkeeper, which is good for you. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, thanks, mate. It's just that a is, bronze French centre back really in it. Oh, yeah, lovely. Bronze French centre back. Mm. Let me just buy my Joe Gomez real quick. Oh, shut up. I, I might actually be nice to you, you know, because Calvert Lewin's on the line now. I actually feel quite bad on you. No, you d don't even pretend like you do. You definitely don't. No, I actually do. No, you don't. No, I, I literally do. Oh, there are some bad ones. <laughs> Wow, they're awful. I would... <laughs> this geezer's got 36 pace. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, there's two with 36 pace. Is that? There is. Oh, are you looking at just French? Can I have French league going, please? Yeah, but I'm, I found one with 36 pace now, so I mean... Oh, the, no, sorry, there is two from French league going with 36 pace. Yep, yeah, brilliant. Cool. Let me compare these, then. Oh, just pick one, FG, for Christ's sake. Just say Matombo and let's get into the game and get this over with. Wait, Come on, right. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> right, yeah, you might as well put him in your team, please. Yeah, brilliant. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I've got a full team. Ladies and gentlemen, make sure you revise before Squad Builder Showdown. All I'm saying, I can't believe you put Kim Pembe and Kante. Like, come on, mate. I need to keep my Calvert-Lewin. I can't believe you broke down Kim Pembe, Marquinhos, and Donnera. <laughs> Just write one of them and cover something else. Come on. Oh, mate, I had a try. I had literally no try. You could have gone to another league, to be fair. Mate, I was going to go Sula, Noya, and that winter wildcard Collins I've been using loads, and he's really written, good. Tap, I would have written Taps over now, probably. But I thought you'll probably write down Sula or Noya, Marquinhos or Donnarumma, and then somebody else. So I was like, all right, let's go a little bit under the radar. I actually love this game, yeah. I hate this game. I, I love this game. Well, it's match. Ladies and gentlemen, it's match day. <laughs> oh, mate, I'm excited. Are you excited? Hello? Let's move on. Good luck, my friend. I wish you nothing but the best. You don't, though. Please stop. The, the lies are making it worse, to be honest with you. <laughs> oh, Langley, what a man. No oh, shower. Nil-nil, then, yeah. What was that? Nil-nil. Is it nil? If it's nil-nil, is there actually no discards? No, nah, it's one each. Wait, why are you trying to pass it around the back against your friend? Oh, God. 
Oh, Dom, don't do this to me. I'll play double it. Rice, rice. What is that? Referee! I'm actually sitting forward. I feel like I'm in a bit of a sweaty game, but I'm not really liking it. I feel sick. Good. Sadio Mane. He's the best player in the world. Save yourself! Oh! Stupid flashback for run. The green, that and everything. Oh, I'm going to concede off this. Dominic! Oh, oh God. that's a big save. Oh, That is no, I passed that too. Okay. Panic stations. Ping it over the top to Dom. Oh, piss off, Varane. I've literally got flashback, Varane. You're actually an animal. I said I respected you. Now I despise you. <laughs> right. Sadio Mane is not the best in the world. But I'm actually playing pretty badly here, you know. Please carry on. Playing really badly, please. Please. Oh, Cavaloon's in the box. Baggio takes it down. Baggio bangs it. No! Right, let's settle down a bit here, lads. Get all over the place. Keep the ball for a bit. Possession football. Right, I can't break it down. You're defending very well and I don't like it. You're not. You're just standing there with Joe Gomez and Varane. Calvin just absolutely sent you the shots multiple times, mate. I'll play oh, stupid up, mate. run! Keeper's already warmed up, mate. Keep your head up, though. Ref, red cards. My ball. Thank That's you. a red card. My ball. Oh my god! How have you not just been sent off? It's my ball. On the ball. Declan Rice, what are you doing? No! Oh, have I not scored? Have you not had a that, red You've card? actually played very well there. That's the best half you've ever played against me. My expected goals are 0.2 and you Your cavalry should have just been night. sent off, mate. You've paid the ref. Oh, the sport should be shambolic, really, isn't it? Disgusting. Can't believe you picked flashback run against friends. Right, let's go, come on. This guy's got two bronze players, mate. Big Dom! Oh! It's a good save. Oh my god, this check is on something. <laughs> What is going on? Oh my god, I'm getting roasted in here as well. He needs testing. Big from LaFont. Big from LaFont. I thought you were going to score your first shot as a little dweeb. That was my second shot. <laughs> no! What? Oh, it's Langley. Oh, Calvert-Loon was in. Well in, Cosa. Referee. Oh, Langley! Yes, Jorginho. Please. Come on, the boys. Come on, the boys! Sorry. No! That was my chance to save the discard! I can't believe it. You actually. Oh, okay. I would have took nil nil if you offered me at the start of the game. I would have took it. You played well. I'm actually rattled. You played very well. You deserve to win that. I was awful. Stupid oh, flashback for Ran. Your check played out of skin, actually, to be fair. Yeah, check was very good, yeah. Okay. One in 11. One in 11. Surely. Surely not. Oh, mate, I'm in Okay. Trouble. You've got a discard as well, FG. Yeah, you go first. No, okay, yeah, yeah, I'll go first, I'll go first. I'm you really gonna get that stupid flashback for Ran. <laughs> Left CDM. Oh, mate, I actually can't discard him, it's Salah. <laughs> He's gone full Nepo. No, I actually physically can't because of Fatal. Looks like you're gonna have to buy a Team of the Year nominee, Salah. No, absolutely not, I'll buy a 92 What do you mean, Salah. absolutely not? I'll buy a 92 Salah. 93 minimum. No, I'll buy a 92. Is there a 92 You're not discarding Salah? less, you little snake in the grass. No, I'm not. Playing with Salah, 850. 92 Salah, 690. Do people want blood? In fact, all right, I'll, depends on who you get from me. I might let you off. Or you can just pick again. I'll give you another. I'll give you two discards for the price of what? Say enough position. What? Say position! Right centre back. The goat, Mutombo. What a man! Did you leave everyone in their position? 
apart from Calvot Lewin, I swapped him with Salah. Right, mate. What do I have to discard is. now? Team of the Year nominee, Salah, please. How have I lost this game? No, I'm not doing Team of the Year nominees. You Salah. are? You just tried to make me discard Calvert Lewin, you evil, evil he's man. He's one point two million. I'll discard. Nah, he's one point zero four. No, I'll discard ninety two Salah. And Varane. Absolutely not. Absolutely, <laughs> absolutely not, mate. Ninety two Salah. I'm, oh my god, he's so expensive. Oh, he's six hundred and ninety k. Actual right. fraudulent scenes, by the way. Yeah. I bought him. Fraudulent, mate. I've bought him. Where am I putting him? In an SBC. Oh, I've kept Calvo. Oh, I've got an Evan special card. I've actually lost this episode. What a time to be alive. Oh, it's good okay. times. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I've got no colors. Thank you very much for watching. Have you put that in an SBC, FG? No, not yet. I'm doing it now. Okay, well, I'll just remind the people then to go and watch some pro clubs. Featuring myself, FG, Danny Ahrens, Kerbs, Itch James, Editor Harry. There is, of course, as well, another Squabble to on over on FG's channel. That'll be coming out, so make sure you I'm go sorry, and subscribe I to him. Tried, by the way. He's rubbish anyway. I've put him in a gold upgrade. Well played, Andy, you won. I've enjoyed myself. That was very stressful. Well played. I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>